It is a privilege to share with you what we have achieved at St Catharines in the year since we published our strategic plan, Our College, Our Future. And we are grateful for the generosity of such supportive alumni and friends, such as you, that will allow us to realise our vision. In February, we announced a transformative gift from alumnus David and Claudia Harding. Their extraordinary donation of £25 million to St Catharines, part of a £100 million gift to the university, was made so that the college can provide, for the first time, fully funded PhD scholarships to the very best applicants, irrespective of background. The Harding Fund will also provide much needed support for our undergraduate students. This new fund enables us to support the students at the heart of our college when and where they most need it. And now we can focus on the section of our plan entitled Our Buildings and Spaces. We intend to improve and increase the number of student rooms on our core estate, including renovation of rooms in Sherlock Court, refurbishment of Hobson's, and the addition of new shared spaces and bedrooms at St Chad's. Transformation of our central spaces, the hall, kitchens, and surrounding environment will mean that, in combination with the McGrath Centre, St Catharines completes the development of a coherent set of dining and meeting spaces that will be the envy of all Cambridge. There is no doubt that this remodelling of our central spaces will improve the college experience for all our members. The hall will be reshaped and reimagined with particular emphasis on aesthetics and acoustics. An atrium and garden room will be created in Chapel Court with better access to all levels of college. Modernised kitchens will enhance the dining experience of all and a new private dining room will provide a more intimate dining occasion. A new purpose-built space for the conservation and display of an important antiquarian book collection will enable greater visibility of this wonderful resource. And we will begin this year. To make all this possible, two members, Peter and Christina Dawson, have made a lead gift of four million pounds. They have also established a matching fund challenge to encourage other members to support this vital project. All gifts received by the college up until December 2021 will be matched by the Dawsons on a one-to-one -one basis up to a maximum of four million pounds, enabling the college to meet all the project's costs. When I accepted the Mastership of St Catharines, I did so with a commitment to enhance our environment so that our students could realise their extraordinary potential. Delivery of the strategic plan, Our College, Our Future, has got off to the most extraordinary start thanks to the generosity of our donors to date. But there is more to do. The vision espoused in Our College, Our Future is not a list of nice-to-haves. Rather, this is what we must deliver in its entirety to honour my commitment to our students. But this can only be done with your help. If you have not yet supported our current campaign, please consider doing so now. Thank you.